How's it people? It's the Friday before, the one that's just been, and it's our first day working here at the lookout on the beacon. We had a really, really amazing meeting at the start of this week. We had the plumbing legend that is Dynamite Dave. We had the electrical genius that is Elliot Holmes from Electro Electrical. We had one half of the dream decorating team, and we had my good friend, our good friend, El Griso. Between us, we all put our heads together and come up with some really good ideas, made a few minor amendments to the plan. Um, things like one of the showers upstairs getting moved across, give the bath more room, little stuff like that. So that's all cool. Um, I've spoken to an instructed building regs. He looked at the plans and he said, this wall has got to stay. You remember me saying last week, I want this to go, make it all open plan, really cool design. Uh, I said, no, 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 it's going. He said, no, 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 it's staying. I said, why is that? He said, so you gotta be able to get from those stairs to that door without going through the kitchen. I said, why? He said, in case it's fire in the kitchen, I said, that's fine, we just won't light any fires in the kitchen. He said, no, no, no. I said, yes, yes, yes. So obviously we've come to a decision between us and um, yeah, we're leaving that wall. Um, these people are so boring, like they really do stifle my creativity. But there we go, that's life, that's the world, no point crying about it. We've had our good friend, John, the absolutely awesome structure engineer. Um, he is probably one of the busiest people I know at the best of times. Anyone who's doing anything with the building industry at the moment will know pretty much everyone is flat out and has been for about a year. Um, he's ridiculously busy. He still managed to turn all the drawings around in it's either 48 or 72 hours. Unbelievable. Um, his first, this bit here, really simple, just big, horrible, heavy steel beam. That's fine. Um, upstairs in the loft, now, you see in my mind, I thought, stick a couple extra four by two timbers in there, brace it up a bit, it'll be fine. He doesn't work like I work. His first interpretation, I would say, contained enough steel to rebuild the Titanic, and we all know how that turned out. Um, so my back said, no, 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 no. Had a discussion between us, floated some ideas about he's managed to reduce the steel by about 60-70%. Still way more than I'd like, but it'll be a decent, solid finish. Um, loads more timber than I was expecting. Um, all the rafters have got to be doubled up and thickened up so that we can t remove the purlings in order to get the Velux windows in. The floor... We've reduced it a lot, but it's still, they're still huge. There's so much timber in there. Um, the price of timber has gone up by about, I think it's about 54% recently. So what this means, you remember last week I spoke about the budget and the schedule. This is the budget and the schedule. Yeah. Might need to think that one again. Um, that's fine, is what it is. We will persevere, stay positive and keep moving. It's Friday afternoon and the end of another sunny week here in paradise. Um, a fairly full on week we've had. You can probably see a bit of a difference in the place now. Whole lot is stripped, ceilings out, um, wiring, electrical stuff out, uh, socket, switches, you name it, out. All the plumbing, pipe work out. So yeah, it's looking a bit different, you could say. Um, the stairs, these nice little find. Really nice old pine stairs. I'll try and leave these. Had a bit of an idea about the parking flooring because I don't love the colour particularly. Um, we're going for a very modern finish with this, like clean lines. So not quite sure if it will look right, but I don't want to lose it either. Um, so yeah, there's no, no woodwork, no nothing. Uh, the only thing we have still got a bit of is um, 
bathroom, we've left a bit of that because all the tiles and stuff will go when we do all the masonry. The rooms here just feel absolutely huge. Yeah, a lot of work stripping everything out. Um, I always find it interesting because house in this state is probably worth 20% less than what I paid for it. But it takes a lot of work to get it to this day. So but yeah, there we go. Anyway, we are not here now for a couple of weeks, um, but I suspect I'll put something out there on a Sunday morning just to keep people entertained. And that's us for this week. Hope everyone's having a fun week. Stay safe. See yous. Bye.